hello and welcome back to my channel glory to jesus honor to mary and joseph every 22nd of september the church celebrates the feast of saint Pio of pietro china but today's feast first on sunday that is why it seems as if it is not being celebrated because every sunday is our easter no other feast is supposed to be celebrated on sunday except the resurrection of our lord jesus christ but every 22nd is the feast of saint pietro china so let us look at the six quotes of pedro pio of pietro china the first quote says pray hope and don't worry worry is useless god is merciful and we hear your prayer the second quote the most beautiful act of faith is the one made in darkness in sacrifice and with extreme effort three the greater the sufferings the greater god's love for you the greater the sufferings the greater god's love for you do you believe that that the greater your suffering is the greater God's love for you. But this is not what we know of in this our modern world. In this our modern world, the greater your suffering is, the greater devil's punishment to you. Because in our own understanding, suffering does not come from God, rather from the enemy. So we need to fight. We need to struggle. We need to pray. But here's Padre Pio telling us, the greater the suffering, the greater God's love for you. Please, do you believe this? Tell me what you think on the comment section. Next quote says, prayer is the best armor we have. It is the key that opens the heart of God. Prayer is the best armor we have. It is the key that opens the heart of God. Love the Madonna and pray the rosary. For her rosary is the weapon against the evils of the world today. The Madonna is Blessed Virgin Mary. So we should love Our Lady and pray her rosary. For her rosary is the weapon against the evils of today. We pray that Saint Padre Pio will obtain for us the grace to persevere in whatever we see in this world. Because he persevered. He was a stigmatist and who endured all the pains he went through because he went through the pains of our lord jesus christ from his hands and his feet and other places he endured he was bleeding but he endured till the end i remember he's one of the incorruptible saints we have in the catholic church because after his death he didn't decay his body remained intact till today so may god give us grace to live a worthy and holy life so that after our stay here we have every cause to glorify god in heaven through jesus christ our lord amen saint pedro pio of pietrachina pray for us ave maria